welcome back to my channel so today i thought i'd do a little what i got for christmas 2019 because i've done this video for like two years running i think and i absolutely love making it and i see obviously a lot of other youtubers doing this sort of video and i really enjoy watching theirs so i thought i'd do it for the third year running i got some cracking presents this year so i'm so so excited to show you what i got i hope everyone had a lovely christmas i had a lovely christmas it was so so relaxing obviously i was working a bit over Christmas but I had Christmas day off though it was so so lovely just to spend it with my family it was the most relaxing day ever I had a lot of food <laughs> a proper food coma I don't think I'm still out of the whole Christmas eating mindset though like I'm still eating way too much but you know that's all what Christmas is all about I'm quite excited for New Year now and just to see what the New Year brings I'm very very excited for 2020 anyway so I'm gonna crack on now with what I got for Christmas this year the first thing is basically I bought myself a couple of presents because there's some stuff that I really really needed so I thought I'd show you those first the first thing that I got myself for Christmas were these lovely 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 paint and throw sort of style shoes they've got sort of like a pleated sole I think that's what you call it they're quite grippy and they're very very sturdy on the toe and the main reason I got these was because I wanted a really really good work shoe because my work shoes have been out of crap for so long like they've got literal holes in them letting all water through and i just wanted some more sturdier shoes for work because I need them <laughs> i'm hoping they'll be work appropriate i think they will be but yeah i love them and they're a little bit sturdier so it makes work a lot easier i don't trap my toes under trolleys and stuff like that they're just like the cutest thing and they're actually really comfortable i actually like wore them around the house the other day i actually got these from shoe zone and they're 14.99 so actually not that cheap and i'm so so excited to rock these at work the thing Thing is i'd probably even wear these just like out of work because they're so cool and i love a good paint and shoe like i've already got my paint and docks which i wear a ton i'm very very excited to keep rocking these in work and outside of work because they're so cool the next thing i bought this is going to be really weird because i'm currently like filming myself but i actually bought this really cool phone case it's yellow and it's got spots on it and it's so cool i needed a phone case for so long my phone is absolutely battered and I've only had it a few months. I got the iPhone XR. I thought I'd treat myself to a little case on Etsy. I'll link all of the girl's details down below because she was so helpful and the communication was really good. And she's just very talented. Like this is all handmade and she did it all herself. And I just love supporting independent artists and brands. And instead of just getting a cheap one from eBay, I thought I'd just hop on Etsy and get one. And look, it has like card holders and stuff. Like it's so cool. I didn't want to get a plastic one you know like the normal plastic ones that you put on the back of your phone i honestly feel like it ruined my old phone so much i, I used to have an android and i bought a plastic case because i thought oh i look really really cool and it was safe it's smashing about it ruined my phone basically it ruined my phone battery and it just ruined the inside of my phone i literally spent like two hours trying to find it though i absolutely love this this was like 25 pounds which is quite a lot of money hopefully this will last the test of time which i think it will i just love it it's just so cool and it just makes my phone look really cool the interesting thing with this phone case as well i feel like i'm looking at my phone less because obviously when i close the phone case you know i can't see my messages and stuff very well which i think is good because i'm an addict like it's ridiculous like i'm always on my phone my boyfriend would tell you that i'm always on my phone hopefully that will also help me to combat my phone addiction because it's greatly needed honestly i'm addicted it's so bad I absolutely love this phone case. I just realised I've literally been talking for seven minutes. The girl is so talented. I think her name is Charlotte. She's like really insanely talented. So obviously I'll link everything down below for you in case you're interested. She's got loads of like really cool phone cases with really, really, really cool designs. So you should definitely check her out. Okay, so the next things that I'm going to show you are from one of my best friends. I went and saw her over Christmas. It is so lovely. So the first thing that she got me was this unicorn pencil and eraser set which is so so cute i love it i don't want to use it though because it's like the cutest thing but i will use them because a pencil will always come in handy for like when i'm just noting stuff down she knows me well she knows i love colors she knows i love cute things and this was a very good present and i also just got like a little candy cane from her that she just put on my present which is so nice i think she said it was like bubblegum flavor so i'm very very excited to try that out 
And then the next thing that she got me are these ombre sticky notes, which are really cool. I'm always in need of sticky notes because I'm always just like jotting stuff down, whether that's like a shopping list or just like random notes. So these are really, really cute. And yeah, I'm definitely gonna be making a lot of notes on these because I've always got stuff to remember and I'm so forgetful as well. Like if I don't write it down, I'll forget. So yeah, these will also come in very, very handy. The next thing I got for my friend was this really, really cute. I actually need to take it out of the packaging to show you. It's like a, it's called a squishy buddy and it sticks on your screen and it's, isn't it like the cutest thing? Hopefully you can see that and it's not blurry. But it's like a little green, I think it's like a green dinosaur slash unicorn. I don't even know if it's like a she or a he, but I'm just going to say it's a she. She's like the cutest thing, to be honest. Like she just sits on my phone screen and it just makes my phone look so much cuter with her on it. I absolutely love her so much. She's a bit of a random present, but I really love her. The only thing is that like just random bits of dust just keep like sticking to her and I can't get it off. I'm very, very happy that my friend rescued her from the shop because she is the cutest. And the last thing that my friend got me is a Lush bath bomb. If you know me, you know that I love, love, love Lush bath bombs. They're like my favourite bath bombs going. And she got me the world's smallest disco ball, which uh, it's so cute inside as well. And she also let me know, and this is really, really cool. I don't know if any of you have tried it, but apparently when you drop it into a bath, the colours actually like shoot out which is really, really cool. I'm very, very excited to use this in my bath. But this is what the bath bomb looks like. Apparently all of these colors just pop out in the bath. I'm so excited to see. It just seems really awesome idea. It's something that I've actually never seen before in a bath bomb. And now I'm literally building. <laughs> so I'm so, so excited to use this. I just love colorful baths and I just find bath bomb just makes the whole bath experience a lot more soothing. So I'm very, very excited to try this in my bath. So the next items that I got are actually from my nan. Like she got me the cutest presents ever. Like I'm so happy with these. So the first thing that she got me is this really, really cool shoe fund money box, which is so handy because I always have so much spare change and cash lied about. So this will definitely come in handy. And I'm obsessed with shoes and probably clothes fund would be <laughs> also a good name to put on this money box for me. And it'd just be good just to see like how much I have in there, just to sort of, in case I need some money, I just love it, it's so pretty. And the other present that my nan got me is so cute. It's this sort of like picture frame, but it's got like a little hanger and it's sort of a bit rustic, which I love. Like this is the sort of wear that I really adore, just like rustic sort of style stuff. And she put on the gift tag, she was like, put a picture of you and Nikki in there, which I thought was really cute because we already have like a little picture frame just up there of us. It'd be cute, but I don't really know where I'm gonna hang this because we don't have that many hooks in this flat but we'll definitely find a place because it will look so cute with a picture of us just there. I love this. It's just so cute. Like, it's just lovely. And I'm very, very happy with this as well. So the next things that I got are from my mum and dad. So the first thing that I got from my mum and dad, this lovely, lovely, lovely bobble hat. Like, this is the cutest thing ever. Like, look at that. It's just so cool. I love it. Like the colours are just insane and it's very, very warm. It's so thick as well. I'm gonna get major hat hair now. <laughs> the colours are so lovely and my mum was really cheeky because I remember seeing this hat in a shop called Rose. I saw it and I was like, oh, that's a really, really cool hat. I love it. And then my mum secretly went and bought it after. This is the cutest hat and I can't get enough of bubble hat. I wear them so much in the winter time because it keeps my head warm and my head usually gets really Really, really cold when I'm just like out and about walking and stuff. So this will come in so handy for like winter walks or if I'm just walking to work or something. This will just keep my head warm. I'm very, very happy with that. This has got like a bit of a story behind it. So these are some Revolution Donut Fizzers. I got my Secret Santa some a like donut fizzer like sort of bath bomb thing and if the secret santa from work is watching this she'll know now that i'm <laughs> the secret santa but it's fine but i remember saying to my mum oh, i've got her you know this present and she obviously kept it together because she got me like a proper set of them which are so cool like i love donuts anyway in a bath bomb 
these will be awesome and they just are so colourful and cute. I'm definitely gonna make use of these because it's lovely, like I just love like cute presents like this, like they're just the best. I'm very happy with these as well and my leg has gone to sleep. So the next thing my parents got me, this is quite like a funny thing because we always have like a running joke that like my mum gets me like really practical sort of present which is really funny so she got me some razors which I actually bought some the other day and she was like really gutted but obviously they'll always come in handy because a girl can never have too many razors these will definitely come in handy for those times that you know I need to de-hair and all that so the next thing that my mum and dad got me are these tights I'm always in need of black tights if you know me my black tights always get holes in like all the time it's terrible literally i'd say i've got about 10 15 pairs of black tights and they all have holes in apart from one these will obviously come in very very handy then they obviously got me some chocolate coins because you can't have christmas without chocolate coins i don't know how i'm filming this like a few days after christmas but i still haven't dug into these they're just like the ultimate christmas present aren't they they're just a staple so obviously i'll enjoy these my mum and dad also got me three pairs of socks and they're really really cute i'm also in dire need of socks like i got really so many the other day i just went and had a proper declutter my mum and dad just got me three new pairs which are obviously come in really handy one pair has got like all different patterns and then like a really cute sausage dog with like a um christmas jacket and hat on which are so cute and then another pair is just like a pink pair with hearts on and then I've also got a blue pair with penguins on, which are so cute. I love how they're like quite wintry themed. Obviously I'll just wear them all year round because socks <laughs> are also kind of very handy. Oh, this is funny. So my parents also got me this shower cap <laughs> because I said that I really needed a shower cap because you know when you just need to go in the shower to just like wash yourself, but you don't want to wash your hair. So my parents just got me a little shower cap just so I could do just that because I don't know, since I've lived at this flat, I used to be such a bath girl. And since I've lived at this flat, I just haven't. I've been more of a shower girl just because I find it easier, it's quicker, and just washing your hair is less of an effort. So this shower cap will definitely come in handy when I'm just on a quick wash and not have to actually get my hair damp because it's so thick and it just takes forever to dry so this will come in very handy as well. My mum and dad also got me some makeup y bits so they got me this Retora More London nail polish which is really really cute i actually didn't know that retour did a collection of rimmel recently this is a lovely 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 purple color of course i'm gonna wear this to death these nails are not looking cute anymore i put on like a just a dark red just for christmas and they're looking worn out so i definitely need to replace my nails with this colour because this is so cute as well and it's perfect for this season and they also got me a new mascara which as well is a funny story because I literally just found an old mascara that I had never used that had just been lingering about so I've just started wearing that and then my mum bought me this one so that is funny but obviously that will also be a very very useful thing to have when I've run out of mascara. My mum and dad also got me this selection box. You cannot have Christmas without a selection box. This is just the Galaxy Christmas collection which has minstrel, a normal galaxy bar, a salted caramel galaxy bar, caramel galaxy bar and two ripples. I love galaxy so much so this is the most ideal collection box for me. I think I actually got this last year from somebody. I don't know if it was my parents or from somebody else but obviously you can never have too much galaxy chocolate in your life. This will get eaten very very quickly. My parents also got me some new bacon trays. Just such an adult thing to say. They got me a oven tray which looks like that. <laughs> they got me a pizza platter because me and my boyfriend live for pizza. Got a baking sheet because I really really want to start baking more so this is obviously a very good present. And then it's some cake tins because again I don't have any and I want to start baking in the new year. Our oven trays are so worn now like I've had them for about five years. I've had them since I was in uni so these will be some really really good replacements for those because they just look absolutely worn out. So I'm gonna go on to what my auntie and cousin got me for Christmas. So the first 
last thing that they got me for Christmas are these really, really cute Lint Elves and Lint Santa chocolates, which are the cutest thing. And obviously they're gonna be demonic. But yeah, I love, 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 love Lint. So these are like the perfect present for me. And obviously I can't get enough of chocolate. So the next thing that my auntie and cousin got me is this Primark gift card. You know me, you know that I'm obsessed with Primark. <laughs> it's probably one of my favourite shops. It's just my go-to for everything, pretty much. And I'm about half an hour, 40 minutes away from a Primark now, so I'm definitely going to be using this. I just love Primark. What else can I say? Oh, I forgot a present that my parents got me. It seems to be like a tradition where they just get me like musical theme gifts, but they got me these really, really lovely I think they're clef notes. I'm a singer, but I don't know if they're clef notes or if they're not. <laughs> they're just so delicate as well, and I can just wear them all the time. I've currently got another note in, and I can't remember what this is. I haven't sung in quite a while, so I need to get back on those singing lessons because I love singing so much. It's like one of my biggest passions. My camera literally just stopped recording, so I've been talking for about half an hour. So I'm gonna try and wrap this up as quickly as I can because this is gonna be a long ass video if I keep on chatting. <laughs> I'm half considering like whether or not to get like a double hole on my earlobe because I've been wanting it for about 10 years but I don't know if I'll actually commit to it. Obviously that'd be like the cutest thing if I had like one note there, one note there. That'd be so sweet. But yeah, these will be like the cutest earrings and hopefully it will actually like make me actually change my earrings because I just don't. <laughs> so the last gift that I got from my auntie and cousin are these really, really cute Kate Spade earrings. I love like Kate Spade as a designer, so that makes me incredibly happy. But these earrings are like so cute. I love the colour. I love the fact they're not too big because I don't usually like really oversized earrings, like big, big chunky ones. So these are gonna be perfect and they're just gonna make my ears a little bit more colorful because I'm usually quite boring when it comes to earrings. Like I just wear the same earrings again and again. These will encourage me to be a bit more adventurous, I think, with my earrings and just jazz up my earring collection. So I'm very, very excited to wear these as well. So the next thing that I got from another one of my friends from Wales that she posted over to me, the first thing that she got me slash made for me is this notebook. It's got all of, well, some of Ariana's outfits on which are just so cool. Like, I love Ariana Grande, obviously. I went to her tour. I'm obsessed with her, obviously. So she just digitally made, like, these outfits, which obviously she wore. I don't know about that black one. That one, I think she wore in her Problem music video. That one is obviously a Dangerous Woman one. That is a No Tears Left to Cry one. And that one, I think it's one that she wore in a live performance, I'm pretty sure. I think it was a side to side performance. This is just like a little notebook, which obviously come in handy. It's just like line. It will come in so handy just writing stuff down, writing down YouTube ideas, writing down anything. And obviously it's got Ariana's outfits in the front, which are actually some of my favorites. Like that is one of my all time favorite of Ariana's outfits. Like, I love her problem outfit. I loved her No Tears Left to Cry outfit. I'm very, very chuffed at that. As you can see, my friend is very talented. <laughs> this is just so cute and it's so unique and I'm definitely gonna be jotting a lot of things down in this. And then the other present she got me, of course, just these matchmakers, which are the orange ones. I've tried the mint ones before, but I've actually not tried the orange ones. So I'm very, very excited to give these a go. And the next thing that I got for Christmas was from my secret Santa at work. It's this Zoella Beauty, I'm dreaming of a bath filled with bubbles gift set. There's no words, like I love Zoella. I love these sort of products. Like there's like a little bubble bath, so bubbly, which is so cute. Got a snow silky lotion, which is for your body, which I'll definitely be giving a go. And then there's like a little flower, flower. <laughs> There's like a little flannel there. I'm always in need of flannel. And some exfoliating mitts if you're a tanner. I'm very, very excited to use this. I've also got the Zoella lunch boxes that I got. I think it was for my birthday or maybe for Christmas last year. That I use all the time when taking my snacks to work. I'm very, very excited to have this into my collection of Zoella products. Next things I'm gonna show you are from my boyfriend. He got me some really funny presents this year. Ones that I actually really, really love. First thing is this mood swing 
an operation sign, which is so useful because when I have a mood swing, which happens not that often actually, but when I sometimes have mood swings, Nick said, oh, I can put this up and he'll know instantly whether I'm in a bad mood or not <laughs> and whether or not basically to leave me alone. So a very, very funny present. And the next thing that he got me are these really, really cute unicorn sock slippers and look how cute they are. They've just got like a unicorn on the front and they're incredibly warm. Like they have a really soft lining. These will definitely keep my feet warm when I'm just snuggling up on the sofa of a cold evening. You can't get enough of slipper socks and comfy socks. Like it's just a staple in the winter time. But these will come in very, very handy. And obviously they're very, very cute. So you cannot go wrong. The next thing that my boyfriend got me are these bath salts. But they're really, really like cool. So I'm very, very excited to try them. But these are the bath salts. And they actually like look really, really pretty. Similar to the fizzes. I'm not sure if these actually create loads of color. I think they probably just like fizz a bit. They're still really cool and they're so pretty. Like I don't want to take them out of the box. They're just beautiful. So obviously they're gonna make my baths heavenly as well, which I'm so so excited about. Like, I cannot get enough of bath products. You know, maybe it'll make me more into a bath girl again. So the next item that my boyfriend got me, it looks so bougie, like it's funny. But it's basically got like a little spoon with it. It's like a little rose spoon and it's got like its own napkin and stuff. It's like really bougie. It's basically this mug. It looks like this, which is actually really, really pretty. It's quite a bougie mug, but I'm all about it. Really, really pretty. And it's just gonna make my glasses of water so much better. I might even have a tea in this. Like it's quite a nice size for a tea. And I just feel fancy like the queen. This looks like the sort of bass that a queen would have. I'll definitely be using this and being bougie as hell. So the next item that my boyfriend got me is actually really funny. I'm actually going to show you this on the internet. Cover that bit up in case people are offended. But basically, my boyfriend made a mug for me that's got a picture of Philip Schofield and like a hunky body because if you've watched my vlogmas, you know I have a little bit of a crush on Philip Schofield. Like, not gonna lie, he is good for his age. So... <laughs> He photo, well, I don't know what he did. He must have photoshopped like head onto like a sexy body. And it has like an interesting slogan, which I'm not going to show you because it's a bit rude. This is going to be a mug that I use all the time. It's actually quite a good coffee mug. This is funny. This is something that I'm not going to get out all the time just because like in case my parents come round, I find it hilarious. I'm going to just enjoy seeing Philip Schofield every day and I'm having my coffee. The last thing that I'm going to show you is this really, really cool cool I guess it's sort of like check like tartan but it's like pink and white and it's like a fluffy hoodie and honestly this is from my boyfriend's parents by the way but this is like so snuggly I just love comfy clothing I like lounging about so this is going to be the most ideal thing it's when it's really really cold sort of like shearling material I guess it's so so warm and it's a little bit oversized which is perfect because when you're lounging you just don't want stuff sticking to you so I like things a little bit more oversized so that will come in very very handy it's just the cutest thing like i love it so much so that is the end of my what i got for christmas video for 2019 i feel like i've been talking for a very long time i feel like i've been talking for about 45 minutes which is going to be a ball to edit if you like this video please remember to give me a like because it will really really help me out and maybe comment what you got for christmas because i'd love to know in the comments and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already thank you so much for watching this video guys and i'll see you next week bye